Hey, what's up? This is Rob from Panther, and today we're going to check it out the latest feature from Midjourney, which is called the Remix. This basically helps you customize already made compositions. So let's say that you have already an image finalized and you forgot some of the elements and now you cannot go back because it's not Photoshop with layers and this and that. So basically you lost that project. Now with this new remix future, basically you can add new futures on that composition or change the composition, edit the style of the composition and so on and so forth. So let's check out some examples. So as a reference, I used a portrait of a tiger as the prompt. So this is what it came out. I added a crown to the tiger. As you can see, it's the same similar composition. Of course, it won't make it 100% the same, but as you can see, the scarf is different also from this. On the third one, I also edited the aspect ratio. And on the fourth option, I also added octane render and more specific prompts in there. And then we got this also. I added beer, I added blue eyes. Now, check this out. I tried to remove the crown, you know, to go back and delete. Basically, I tried to delete the crown and, <laughs> and this is what it came out. So removing elements is not doing that well, but adding elements and adding styles, it's gonna make it pretty good. And also it removed the blue eyes. And here you can see all the variations, the evolution at least. After you add the octane render, it's gonna change the whole style and the composition. So anyways, I'm gonna show you how to do this. But before we do that, if you wanna see how to create like super realistic cyborg robots, halfway human, halfway robot, you can join the members only channel. You can click the join button near the subscription button and select secret content. They're basically going to learn how to create super realistic portraits, how to combine with cyborgs, how to put the models in different positions. I'm going to show you like perfect face prompts, also prompts from these cyborgs and different composition settings. All right, so how to activate this feature because it's not active. You're going to need to type in slash settings, type in enter, enter again. And you can see it here, the remix mode. You just need to activate it. So you're going to type in slash imagine space portrait of a pit bull. Okay, so this is the first attempt. Now I can try to put sunglasses on, on the same exact model. I can choose, I like the third one. So I'm gonna go, we got the V3. And check this out, if I click on it, it's gonna pop up this window. And here we got the prompts that we used. And I'm gonna add portrait of a pit bull wearing sunglasses. And you click on submit. So look at that, it's gonna give me like really similar characters of the dog that I selected this one. And it's gonna give me like different sunglasses, different poses. Of course, it won't make like the same exact dog because it cannot do it, but it's gonna make something more similar. So I'm gonna go with the first one and I'm gonna click on V1. I'm also gonna type in their octane render. 8K, let's see what happens. And check this out with the octane render. It makes it more realistic looking, more three-dimensional. And it looks really, really good compared to this one, which is more painty looking. And now we're going to check out the pit bulls and compare them to see the differences. So this was the first one without any prompts. Now I added the glass. Thirdly, I added the octane render, cinematic and 8K. Not but least, I also added like a pink sunglasses. And then it also made the face pink. So at the end, as you can see, this is the evolution. First two is without octane render and the last two is with the octane render. The first two is more painty looking and the last two is more 3D looking. And this was it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can notify with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Goodbye.